often referred to as January, and us British Columbians are used to this. But what we aren't used to is all the snow still up here. That's concerning because uh, you know we're really squeezing the, the sort of period of time that we, we melt that snow off. The head of the River Forecast Center, David Campbell, is watching closely as we enter a critical weather month. So we're kind of getting to the time here where it's expected to be warmer and, and with all of that snow kind of still there, that, that risk of, of how it comes down is, is certainly present. Worst case for flooding in BC could happen in the next few weeks. That critical window when we're most vulnerable to extreme weather. Too much rain and too much heat is a dangerous combination. In the short term, we have concerns over uh, heavy rainfall that's coming in parts of the province. The hot weather scenario is concerning, particularly over the next few weeks, that's going to continue to be a concern. And that would really be extended periods of extreme heat. So, you know, eight, 10 degrees above normal. A combination we've avoided up until now. There hasn't been any extraordinary rain, extraordinary heat. So we're kind of dodging a lot of bullets here with fire weather and with the freshet. So June is going to be a really, really interesting month. Environment Canada meteorologist Doug Lundquist has his eye on thunderstorms. Probably the thing I'm most concerned about this year. And the reason is thunderstorms often come with heavy downpours. So even if we get an extended rain, say in the interior with some embedded thunderstorms or convection, this is what tends to throw us over the top. There are two areas in the province that are at most risk of flooding. Um, we're certainly concerned about the high snowpacks through the, the Caribou and Rocky Mountains, which could impact places like Prince George or Kamloops uh, in terms of major centers, uh, but also a number of smaller communities that have exposure on, on those kind of rivers. The best case scenario for BC to dodge flooding is no extreme weather. Mild weather, even you know, seasonal weather is probably fine. We can handle short bursts of warm weather um, that isn't too extreme. So, you know, a, a day or you know, we saw that last week, um, you know, a couple days of above normal temperatures is not uh, is not causing too many problems. So if you wanted a hot summer, be careful what you wish for. Elena Kelly, Glacier Media, Vancouver.